Hi everybody, my name is Sebastiano Galazzo and I will showcase a project uh, focused on reading uh, brain waves. Since a lot of time, uh, brain wave reading uh, has always been considered uh, very complex and intimidating, uh, as uh, uh, generally we thought uh, people with uh, tons of cable and uh, very, very difficult to, to uh, analyze. But of course, tech technology is going forward. And today, thanks to a device like that one, that is possible to buy on Amazon for $100, uh, you have the possibility to analyze brain waves, to get a lot of parameters, and to make uh, something, uh, in, in my opinion, could be amazing. Basically, this is the device. It has a sensor in front of that and uh, capture your brainwave activity. What I did uh, is to analyze the raw data that uh, are sent in an uh, analogical uh, way and treated with a uh, fast Fourier trust transform to get uh, uh, the most important frequencies uh, that we need uh, for our project. And uh, was implemented a custom uh, uh, fast Fourier transform. But which kind of uh, uh, data we can uh, get from that device? Uh, the, uh, our brain, where, uh, when it works, produces uh, different waves that uh, are categorized as alpha waves, beta waves, gamma waves, delta, and theta waves. Each one is uh, um, as a value, as a spike, uh, uh, based on some activity. For example, if you are very, very focused on something, you produce a high level of beta waves. Or uh, if you are stressed um, or uh, during meditation, maybe that you are using uh, theta waves or alpha waves. Here, a quick tour in detail. Uh, this is uh, delta waves that uh, are involved when uh, um, your brain is uh, very, very relaxed or is uh, most sleeping and, in un and is unconscious. Theta waves are involved when you use your brain uh, for creative task, uh, when you recall something or um, you are imagining something. Alpha waves that has this kind of frequency. So this is the, the reason why I use the fast Fourier transform. Uh, are involved when you are uh, meditation for long-term memory. Beta waves are the most interesting from uh, my point of view for the project I did because are most involved when uh, uh, you are thinking to something. You are very focused on, uh, on your task. And, uh, but there are a particular frequencies of beta waves that are very interesting, that are high beta waves that are involved when you are stressed. And finally, there are gamma waves. Gamma waves are involved when uh, uh, there is an hyperactivity of your brain. Of course, everything has been created um, was aked the protocol of the device and created uh, a custom library that I plan to release for all developers in the next week. This is uh, an example of, the, of a software, the, the main software that I produced. In that moment, uh, uh, is used for spot application. I hope to showcase you a video soon. And uh, the coach, can read uh, your attention level, your meditation level, your stress level, in order to uh, produce the best training session for you. But also uh, could be used also in, uh, in medicine or in health. Let's imagine for people affected by uh, ALS, that of, uh, had a very huge problem of com communication. 
For example, analyzing the pattern of your mind is possible to move a cursor around a keyboard and uh, uh, to select the chart that, that you want to uh, choose blinking your eyes. Of course, it's also possible to use uh, uh, in games. This is a game I made, is uh, also possible in Qt, that uh, um, now, yes, <laughs> there is very few time uh, and uh, I can show, showcase now, but if you want to try, I, uh, I will be happy to everybody to test. It's a snail that you can move with the power of your mind. So, uh, you wear the headset and uh, if you focus to something, uh, the most attention you are, the faster the snail moves. Now I hope to showcase, here is a video, oh it's not possible to see, okay. I don't know why. Anyway, I can show you. The, I can't show you the video. Anyway, this is the project. <laughs> now uh, the video doesn't work, so sorry for that. Anyway, this is the idea. So you can use your brain analyzing patterns and uh, to make action that could be involved uh, on games, on uh, UI or uh, used on uh, uh, spot application. At the moment, uh, I, uh, I'm using uh, this software, Brainwave Studio, on clay shooting to analyze uh, the movement of the shooting of the shooter uh, while he's making his gesture and the coach uh, behind you that analyze your uh, brain pattern. Uh, what was amazing was that uh, the coach was able to predict my two fault uh, just analyzing the brain pattern. And so uh, this, is, uh, this has a very great value for a, a lot of people uh, like coach if we are talking about sport, in health if we are talking about people uh, with communication problem or in games as we can use uh, uh, that indicator like attention level, meditation level, to move object uh, or to do something. That's all. So, don't, of course, do not forget to vote me. Sebastiano Galazzo, these are my... Oh. Perfect. I see the slide, but not there. Vote me, Sebastiano Galazzo for brainwave analysis. Thank you very much, Sebastiano Galazzo.